thank you for choosing a Yale LiftMaster Smart Keypad Lever or Smart Touchscreen Deadbolt. There are two ways to control the Smart Lock using the MyQ app. The first is local control using the Bluetooth signal from your phone when you're within range of the lock. The other way is from anywhere through the internet using a Wi-Fi connection. For this, you'll need to install the LiftMaster Smart Garage Control within Bluetooth range of the lock, but we'll talk more about that later. Only follow the steps in this video after you have installed the lock hardware, completing all the steps in the fold-out installation manual. If you need help with that, visit support.chamberlaingroup.com and search for the Yale LiftMaster lock installation video. For this demonstration, we've installed the lock on the door that leads into the garage. We happen to have a compatible garage door opener that we can pair to the smart garage control. You can learn more about that on support.chamberlaingroup.com. The steps we'll walk through in this video apply to both the lever and deadbolt style locks. In this overview, we'll cover preparing the lock for setup in the MyQ app, installing the MyQ app, and setting up local control for the lock. Then we'll show you how to set up the hub in the MyQ app, pair the lock to the hub, and place the hub within Bluetooth range of the lock. Follow the progress menu at the bottom of the screen to see where you are in the setup, or if you need to go back and watch a step over again. This video is intended for demonstration purposes only. Please consult the quick start guide for instructions and safety information. Let's check a few things before we get started. First, you need to know your master code. Your lock may have been installed by someone else, so you may need to set up the master code now for the first time. Follow the steps for the style of lock you have installed. For a deadbolt lock, touch the touchscreen. Touch the gear. Enter a pin code that is between four and eight digits long. Touch the gear. Now touch the screen to complete handing. That's it. For a lever lock, press the gear button. Press 1. Press the gear button. Enter a pin code that is between 4 and 8 digits long. Press the gear button. Your master code is set. Try it out. The lock will unlock. Now, enable Bluetooth on your mobile device. Enable location services on your mobile device. Now, let's get your smart lock set up in the MyQ app. These steps will help both Apple and Android users. Some screens may appear slightly different. You'll need to get the latest MyQ app installed. Go to the App Store or Google Play and search for MyQ. Several apps will appear. Choose the app with this logo called MyQ Garage and Access Control. Go ahead and install that one. If you have an older version of the MyQ app that doesn't have this icon, go download the latest app. When you launch the app, you'll be prompted to either sign in or sign up for a MyQ account. Fill in and submit your information. As a new user, you'll receive an email to complete your registration. Follow the instructions in the email. Then, you'll be able to log into your account on the app. Remove the battery cover. It's time to set up your smart lock in the MyQ app so you can control it locally using your phone's Bluetooth. Open the MyQ app. If you already have devices on your account, tap the plus on the home screen. Then select device from the pop-up menu. This takes you to the device setup screen. New users will automatically start here. Choose the smart lock. Tap the type of lock that you have installed. We'll choose the deadbolt lock. Confirm that your lock is already installed by tapping Lock is installed. You'll be reminded about a few things you'll need. A strong Wi-Fi connection. Bluetooth enabled on your phone. And your phone and lock need to be within Bluetooth range. Tap Next. Remove one battery. Tap Next. There's a 10-digit serial number located on the network module. Enter the 10-digit serial number in the MyQ app, then tap Done. The app may prompt you to insert your network module. This should already be in place from when you followed the lock installation instructions. 
If it isn't, insert it now with the connector facing into the lock. Now, go ahead and reinstall the battery. Put the battery cover back on. Tap Next. Manually make sure your lock is in the locked position. For a deadbolt lock, touch the screen to make the numbers appear. For both lever and deadbolt locks, enter the master pin code, then press the gear icon. Press 7, then press the gear icon again. Now press the red back arrow twice. The lock will respond. Tap Next. The app will work on discovering your lock. Your lock's 10-digit serial number will show up on the Discovered screen. Tap the lock. Let's name your lock. You can either choose a pre-named lock from the list or tap Custom to create your own personalized lock name. Tap Next. Your lock will be added to your account. This may take a few moments. Local setup is complete. You will be given the option to continue with Wi-Fi setup. Tap Yes, let's get it online. Okay, what about the smart garage control? You've probably heard it can be used to control a compatible garage door opener as well as your lock. It's true. To complete the full setup, visit support.chamberlaingroup.com and search for the smart garage control installation video. But if you're only interested in setting up your lock, follow these steps. So, what's in the box? A Wi Fi hub, a mounting plate a door sensor, a power cord, and mounting hardware and hook and loop strips. We'll only be setting up the Wi-Fi hub, so tuck the door sensor and the hook and loop strips away in a safe place in case you decide to set up a garage door opener later. In the MyQ app, tap Set Up New Hub. The checklist of things you'll need includes a strong Wi-Fi signal where you're going to mount the hub, the password for your Wi-Fi network, and Bluetooth enabled on your smartphone. Go ahead and put a check mark by all of the items in order to go on to the next step. Tap I'm ready. Go ahead and plug in the hub. You will see a blinking blue light. Tap Next. In the app, the hub will be listed as a discovered device. Tap the hub to continue. If you receive a Bluetooth pairing request, tap Pair. All users need to choose your home network. Make sure you enter the correct password for your Wi-Fi network. The LEDs on the hub will begin to flash. When the LED turns solid green, congratulations, you're connected. Tap Next. Pairing the lock to the hub may take a few moments. When pairing is successful, tap Next. You'll be reminded to make sure your hub is installed within Bluetooth range of the lock. Tap Done. Your lock is listed on the home screen, and you can control it either using your phone's Bluetooth or over the internet through the MyQ app. Remember, you need to keep the hub within Bluetooth range of the lock. Your smart lock is ready to use. Go ahead, give it a try. For more information, visit support.chamberlaingroup.com. Thank you for choosing LiftMaster.